These two, tough card for them to have to play, but Australia have just seized the moment, and I think it's fair enough to say when, not if today, but still got to get it done. That is a lovely drive, and it's scorching across the outfield. Nice chase, but even Manus can't run that down. say timed it perfectly, but he's got to get the same result. A little bit squarer, so twice in the over. Top edge and can't control it this time. So your strength can be your weakness, and it's never better personified than that little piece of cricket action. Yeah, he's a compulsive hooker to Silver, and unfortunately he just could not get this one to ground. Well, it's an unconvincing shot, but it's gone up and over the slip cordon. Dangerous business for Joseph, but West Indies now trail by one. Bandera. This time there's an edge, and it's gone through Mitch Stark. He gets Alzari Joseph, and the West Indies are eight down. Yeah, that's what he's been trying to do. Out! Josh Hazelwood has fought. His 11th in Test cricket, and the half can do no wrong at the moment. Four for in the first, he's sitting on nine for, and five for 21 in this innings. What a performance. Oh, Shamar Joseph, what a Test match he's having. He starts with a, a gorgeous drive through the covers. Should have opened the batting. 100%. Delightful stroke. These two put on 55 in the first innings. And Kimar Roach, another divine drive. Fair and fine leg twice. A bit of aggression from Joseph. That's Shamar. He will attack. And that's how you do it. You get Steve Smith to do your yeah. shoelaces for yeah. you. Bugs. Him out, first ball. <laughs> I get my bunny to do that. <laughs> <laughs> Got after that one as well, Shamar Joseph. We saw one launched into the stands for six to the leg side. This time he keeps it down for four. Another lovely drive right into the slot for Roach. Oh, he does go for it. And Nathan Lyon with his second ball entices Joseph down the track. And the West Indies are all out. Josh Hazelwood, the hero, what a match he's had. He could, he could make a shot put stand up off a good length. <laughs> and here they emerge, Steve Smith, Usman Khawaja. Just 26 needed to win this test match. First delivery. Yep. And he's away. A little bit of relief there. I know he's an experienced campaigner, but you like to get off the mark. Oh, pulled away nicely. There wasn't a lot of pace on that from uh, Zari Joseph, but Steve Smith climbed all over it through the offside. It'll tease the rope and it will get there. So another boundary to Smith. And Kawaja puts him away for a boundary. A Ten now to win for Australia. Oh, nasty. Nearly onto the stumps as well. Well, that's got him hard. Usman Kawaja. Every chance that's got him flush, Brian Lara, and there's every chance that could do some serious damage to his jaw. Right thing to do, to come off. Mm. Oh, the well, there's, there's no point in him staying out there. And you've got to feel Fulsman Kawaja batter well in the first innings, and he was one run away from celebrating with the Australians this afternoon, and you might have to go for a scan now. Yeah. He works it to the next side, Marlis Lavashane, and with that, Australia win. In the sunshine here in Adelaide, they win by 10 wickets inside three days and they retain the Frank Worrell Trophy.